Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the error tunnel connection failed you're getting when browsing on the internet. So typically this will occur on the Google Chrome web browser when your browser is unable to establish a tunnel connection to the host server. So if you're using a proxy server, you're more likely to run across this type of error. And we're going to jump right into it. So the first thing I would actually suggest if you were not aware you're using a proxy server or if you didn't want to use one to begin with or perhaps you just don't really care, um, let's go through that first. However, I am going to have other methods to hopefully resolve that. So let's just say you didn't mind disabling it. Let's just go underneath the start menu and type in configure proxy. And the best matches should say configure proxy server. Left click on that. Now underneath connections, you want to go and left click on LAN settings near the bottom. So underneath local area network settings, left click on LAN settings. You want to uncheck a box where it says use proxy server for your LAN. So if this is check marked in here, you want to uncheck it or deselect it. Left click on OK and then left click on OK again. We we'll suggest restarting your computer and hopefully that resolved the problem. Now if it did not, next thing I would try after restarting your computer and trying again would be to open up the start menu, just left click on the start button at one time, type in CMD, best match should come back with command prompt, you want to right click on that, and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, you want to left click on yes. Now the first command you want to type in is ipconfig, exactly it appears on my screen, space forward slash flush DNS exactly how it appears. So again IP config space forward slash flush DNS. Then you want to hit enter on your keyboard. It should say Windows IP configuration successfully flush to DNS resolver cache. Now okay the next command you want to type in is NETSH space INT space IP space reset. So again NETSH space INT space IP space reset. Then you want to hit enter on your keyboard. Once you've done that, now you want to go ahead and type in NETSH space WINSOCK, W-I-N-S-O-C-K, space reset. And then you want to hit enter again. You will have to restart your computer in order to complete the reset. So it was just trying to restart your computer. Hopefully that has resolved the problem at that time. So if we close out of here. Again, try to restart your computer. Hopefully that has resolved the problem. And as always, thank you for watching, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.